Hello guys, Doggy from Prepared to Escape, and today I'm going to do a review of the iPad Mini. Uh, so yeah, I've had this device since it first came out, and I really think it's an awesome device. Uh, I love this tablet, uh, and uh, what I really like about it is the portability, and uh, because it's just so extremely light and thin, and I think it's really awesome. Uh, so yeah, it's really easy to carry around, uh, which makes it perfect to have, for, for example, school, or if you're just going on, for example, a subway or something like that. Uh, so yeah, it's a 7.9 inch screen, and yeah, I really like that screen size because it's not too big, but also not too small. Uh, and yeah, what I use my iPad for is mainly to watch Netflix and, and browse the internet, and of course play some games, uh, let's, uh, look at my mail and such. Uh, and yeah, I really find this device really good to use uh, as a secondary computer as well uh, because you can watch your mail and do other light tasks. You can actually edit uh, videos on it, which is really awesome. Uh, and uh, yeah, I'm actually using the smart cover for it as well. And I really like the smart cover because it really it, mo it doesn't only protect your iPad, but it also makes it. Yeah, you're gonna see in the video right uh, pretty soon. Uh, it also makes it uh, like a stand, which is really nice, for example, if you're going to watch a movie or just type. Uh, so yeah, I really like that about it. And uh, yeah, also, of course, um, the screen. A lot of people have been uh, complaining about the screen a bit, that it's uh, not Retina. Uh, but I can assure you, I at least I think it's really awesome. Uh, I've uh, Yeah, I've had it since it came out, and I think I haven't really had any problems with the screen at all. I think it's a really nice screen, but but yeah, uh, of course a Retina one would be better. So yeah, I actually really like this tablet, and uh, do I recommend you to get it? Absolutely, uh, I really like it, and uh, well, if you're going to that for that small form factor, uh, this one is really nice. Uh, if you just want an iPad for like a bit of heavy heavier tasks, I would recommend the iPad 4, uh, because it's quite, it's got a nice chip in it. Um, but yeah, uh, so yeah, I, I actually really recommend this. It's uh, actually quite a, quite a good price for the device as well. And uh, yeah, if you want to wait a couple of more months, it will actually be uh, be a Retina screen on the iPad Mini 2. Uh, so yeah, uh, uh, so yeah, please write down in the comments what you think about the iPad uh, if you already have one or if you if you like them. Uh, so yeah, we can actually see a couple of uh, uh, screens now, or a couple of photos right now from the iPad. It has a 5 megapixel camera, which is actually quite decent. I, I actually think it's pretty nice, and a full HD uh, video recorder, which actually takes a lot of uh, really nice photos. It actually, I think it outruns the iPhone 4S uh, in in photos, which is really nice. Uh, and it might be looking a bit weird because I was filming through a window. But but yeah, I, I really like this device. As you could see in in the video as well, it's it's really light. It's it's, a, it's like a pencil, and it's about uh, 200 grams, 300 grams, something like that. Uh, so yeah, it's really awesome. Hopefully you like this video. And I'll see you later. Bye.